fundamentally a disabled cousin, which was weird growing up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> which was weird growing up, because like, we'd go to Easter dinner, and he'd be wearing a helmet, and I'm like, fuck yeah, are we going rollerblading? <laughs> like, oh, sorry buddy, your cousin's just a little top heavy. <laughs> and the corners and coffee tables have become his mortal enemy, so we strapped his helmet on. <laughs> Uh, how you guys doing tonight? Doing well? I love being in Port Deposit. I saw a mullet earlier. Ow! <laughs> Dude, a mullet is my fucking favorite haircut because it's business in the front, party in the back, and illiteracy and spousal abuse in the middle. <laughs> I like mullets because when you see it it's like oh I never have to listen to anything that you say <laughs> like, when, like you'll never hear me say oh, sh dude shut up for a second the guy with the mullet is about to say something important <laughs> like that will never ever fucking happen uh yeah too so uh I still live I live I'm 25 and I live with my parents <laughs> look how the all girl all the girls are like <laughs> not fucking you <laughs> I have a sweet futon. It's from Ikea. It's called a cup, cup. <laughs> yeah. But, um, I, 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 yeah, I sleep, I sleep in the basement a lot. My friends are at that front table right there if you want to get But, uh, um, my parents, my parents left, like, went on a vacation the other day, and it was fucking awesome. Like, I just had, like, a freestyle jerk off session. Like, I put my socks on, I was, like, sliding across the coffee table, like, fucking backside jerk off uh, into a Shane 360. <laughs> Then, uh, then I was watching. I was watching porn, and I saw people using a double-sided dildo. Which I don't know what fucking perverted genius came up with this shit. But I would love to have been there for the board meeting. Like, um, so I got an idea. It's pretty much just uh, it's like a plastic dick right. just walk strapped through it. Just to the back of a plastic <laughs> dick. It's just Justin. And, just walk um, through it. It's okay. Well, you know that scene from Lady and the Tramp. <laughs> Burger and spaghetti? I do. Well, it's pretty much like that, except instead of dogs, it's humans. And instead of spaghetti, it's plastic dicks. <laughs> By George, you got it! You're a fucking genius. That's why we call you the plastic dick salesman of the month. So, um, I went to McDonald's the other day, and, uh, I was really high, which, do you guys smoke pot at all? Yeah. Woo! Alright, so beside the stoners, you guys are all cops. Just put them wherever you like. Fucking don't follow me out. Where was he? That's where we were talking about. There's a raffle table over there. Oh, sorry. I already got a call to you. Thank uh, yeah, but I went, I went to McDonald's, and like, I didn't mean to do it, but I accidentally ordered the entire dollar menu, and the fucking lady nice. gave me like this disgusted look, and it was the like, weird right old now, white lady that worked at every McDonald's who's like older than everyone else that worked there, like the lady who you know goes home and feeds her cats all the time, it's like, oh, here's one for Mr. Whiskers, and one for me. <laughs> yeah, we're at nine yeah, right she now. She gave me this judgmental look, and I was Justin's like, "What's feeling so bad right now? They're just letting him go." You okay, work at McDonald's, and you're 65 years old. He also looks your really sexy up there. Your tits are tucked underwear. I think if you told everybody you went to a strip club last night, they would totally start laughing again. Why don't you work that judgmental look? Crazy, go make me a fucking McGriddle. <laughs> so you went to a strip club last night. Because that's what Santa came here for. <laughs> If I could, if I followed him, that's what I would say in my whole set. <laughs> what does it look like? How much time do I got left? <laughs> like negative two minutes. Just keep going. Can't do that. I can only have a specific amount written. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's going good. I don't know. What the fuck else do I got? Jesus! Strip club!
I did go. I told you about that. Keep it. Do it. Do it again. <laughs> they loved it. Oh, uh, that's it. Yeah, a lot of things in the bathroom. <laughs> Ginger babies. Ginger babies. <laughs> <laughs> it does suck having red hair. <laughs> <laughs> because every time I see an old woman, she's like, oh, I have a grandson that just looks, looks yeah. just like you. <laughs> and that's racist. <laughs> Most old white women are racist, so. <laughs> uh, just goes <with> it. Uh, <laughs> no, half the things I don't make fun of. Uh, yeah, so um, I know I know I don't look fat, which means my man spanks are working. <laughs> but like, I took I took a sh bath the other day, which I usually don't do. <laughs> Cause like when I take a shower, I like have enough room to fucking play a fucking soccer game. No, I heard about but this. when I take a bath, it's like every every hole of the bathtub is filled with the fatness of my body. Like when I lay down, I kind of look like ET, which is weird because when you feed me Reese's pieces, my dick lives. It's convenient, but. Yeah, like I took a, I took a bath. Okay. When, yeah, but, right but I used to, I, I have two younger brothers, and yeah, when we used to take baths yeah. together, like, <laughs> you could fit like a tire in there, and even then, our little boy balls and dicks still wouldn't touch. <laughs> but like when I take a bath now, it's, oh uh, god, it's gross. Like, have you ever jerked off in the bathtub? <laughs> Any guy who didn't say yeah is fucking lying. <laughs> If you can fucking stare at your dick for more than 10 seconds without backing <laughs> it around, you're, there's something wrong with you. You're a serial killer. <laughs> there's something obvious that would spit everywhere. <laughs> yeah. I jerked off in the bathtub recently. It's like a fucking vengeful cum jellyfish. Cause it's like, ah! Get away from me! You can't pick it up. It just slips to your fingers. It's like, what is there? A BP oil spill coming through my balls? So I just did the most logical thing I could think of. I ate it. <laughs> it was Bob and Prapple style. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't happen. You did. You did. If I got you did that. No, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. Keep going! <laughs> I got nothing else! Strip club! <laughs>